so here we have a partial sacrifice bed because most of the stuff I do is only about 62 centimeters square this is just for bigger stuff if I get like a gate or a table or something like that in I'll just take this off but from that side of the bed to this side of the bed there's that much difference so put spirit level on the table it's level spirit level it's in the middle see but when the machine set all up it still has to find its own level so uh, for a sacrifice bed i just found a piece of old wood bigger than what i use because i only use 62 centimeter wood so I got a bigger piece that was about 100 centimetres by 100 centimetres than I did a, a cord that cleaned it all off. So you run a cord and it cleans it all off and makes it all perfectly flat. So when you put your next piece of wood on, it's on a flat surface and it's not slanted over one side. So this becomes your new bed and you do any mistakes, you just destroy this one. And that's why I never put a big one on because I've got it attached to me desk so the computers are here desks there so I just built the whole desk just for the CNC yeah but I needed a sacrifice bed because like I said it's a good three mil deeper over here and it's just here touching over there so but if you go on the spirit level it's bang on so yeah I don't know I think everybody has to do like a spirit like clear the bed off no matter what machine it is but uh hopefully i get these made and they're going to have like a starting point in the middle and it's going to go out 20 centimeters and another 20 centimeters and another 20 centimeters so it'll have like a grid reference on so when you put your part on you know to start in the middle and you know how big it is so you just only have to measure it with your tape measure so you'll see on here 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters so you put it in the center and you'll know it's 10 centimeters by 10 centimeters so we'll make a sacrifice bed up as well another project uh, this file's already available but i can do better but you're more than welcome to print it out and have a go and when i give you the better files in fact you might as well just print the better files out but cnc mostly printed homemade Built, not bought, not donated, not given to me by somebody to give a review. It's my own machine, made it myself, I review it myself, and I find the problems myself. I bitch about it myself, and I do it for myself. This is to show the grandkids how to make a few quid in the future from a 3D printer. If anybody wants to tag along, they're more than welcome. I do all the files for free.